everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. I swear normally I do not start my videos crying and that I'm not an emotional mess in all my videos. But as you guys can see, we lost our family dog Abby and I'm sure almost all of you know who she is. You guys loved seeing her here on my channel and she was definitely one of my most popular guests. And so I really just wanted to make a quick video of a bunch of different clips of Abby and I and Abby in general to look back on. Unfortunately, she passed away unexpectedly on June 5th. 2017. Basically what happened is my grandfather had to take her to the emergency vet in the middle of the night on June 4th and then on June 5th they were told to follow up with the regular vet and as they were going there she passed away and at the vet they tried to revive her and they couldn't. They did everything they could. We've had Abby since she was a couple months old and she just recently turned to five and we had a puppy party for her and everything. We got her on September 8th 2012 and ever since that day she's been my best friend and and it's definitely been hard and different without her here and I miss her every day and so I just thought it'd be fun to make a video I can always look back on so here are a bunch of my favorite moments with Abby so this is my dog Abby she is seven months old she is a Jack Russell Terrier Beagle mix this is her first time experiencing snap Abby Abby, high five. Yes. Be doing the furry friend tag. My pet's name is Abby and I actually got to name her when we got her. So this is Abby. She's a Jack Russell Terrier Beagle mix but she definitely has some sort of hunting dog in her. We're not too sure what though. Abby was originally a stray and she is a rescue dog from the animal shelter. She thinks she's a lap dog and she's not. She's 52 pounds and a big full grown dog. She sometimes acts like a cat because she likes to purr. You probably think I'm kidding but I'm not. At night when you're like sitting on the ground with her rubbing her belly or anything rubbing her ears she will literally purr like a cat. It is hilarious. My relationship with Abby is everything to me. She's my best friend. We do so much together. We're always going on WALKs. Yes, I had to spell it because if I said it, then she'd want to go. We go for car rides. She and I have sleepovers. We do a lot together. When I'm sitting in this chair, she likes to get up in my lap. The other day, we were sitting at the table and playing dominoes, and she got up in my lap. And keep in mind, this dog is like 52, 53 pounds. There are tons of others. I love spending time with Abby. While we were waiting for the cookies to bake, I let Abby lick the peanut butter off the spoon. I'm trying to vlog. The dog <laughs> fails in, in the face. Hi, do I know you? <laughs> Abby, come on. A bunch of 
bunch of my favorite moments with Abby. I hope you guys like this video. If you've ever lost a pet, I know exactly how you feel. I am super thankful that I do have footage of her and I and got to do the furry friend tag and everything like that. And I'm also very thankful that I did get the opportunity to work with BarkBox and give Abby a three month subscription to that because she absolutely loved it. I want to thank you all for your love and support on my other social media platforms, which I will have linked down below. I really appreciate it. And the last thing I want to mention is that any videos you've seen prior to this one have been pre-filmed, which is why I was all happy-go-lucky and everything. And it's definitely taken me quite a few tries to get this video, and I still can't do it without crying, so I figured, hey, why not just show the real me? I hope you guys liked this video, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys! Mm -hmm.